We've got Songbird on comms. She's fine. Found us a safe house nearby, too. Songbird. I'd started to worry. I suppose I forgot she always lands on her feet. A crazy luck, both of you. Huh. Maybe you brought it with you. Nightmare. My people dead. Well, was it because of me? Whoa, whoa. Kurt Hansen killed them. Not you. <sighs> Is that what you think? You have no idea how deep this goes. We were hacked. It means Hansen had help. From Washington. The NUS government is aware of the crash, no doubt. They'll have sat mapped it, seen us hit the ground in Dogtown. Unless... Unless the plot goes deeper. Hansen spreading his agitprop lies as we speak. I'm sure of it. Our people will have an even harder time crossing the border. I can't trust a soul. I just... Fuck! I don't know what to do. Understanding concerns. Don't forget, you got me here, though. You? And Songbird. We'll get you out of this mess. Thank you, V. We stick to the plan. After that, guess we'll see. Wait a second. Damn it! If Hansen's got someone inside in Washington, that means I'm traceable. Wherever, whenever. I have a subdermal tracker. It needs to go ASAP. It's near an artery that's best not nicked. I'll need your help. Jibbing the prez with a tracker? Weird. Safety precaution. In case I ever wanted to ditch the White House. Go on an all-night bender. Can you help? Assume you know what you're doing. Be completely on your own without the tracker. Well, you're here. Close your eyes. Think of some asshole you hate. Always helps. Ugh. Ugh. That's a long list. Even better. Wait, is that... Drone, finish up, quick. Cover it now! That was close. V? I'm here. Right on time. You in one piece? For now. Can't say I'll stay that way. We need to get to the top of the building. Talk later. Got Songbird on comms. Says we gotta climb higher. Lead the way. It's your city, after all. Kurtz, hounds have caught your scent. You need to move. Delta time. Let's go. We'll ask our guardian angel if she can get this elevator moving. Elevator could use a runner's touch, Song. Already on it. Uh-huh. Sorry, V. My magic's no good here. What we need's power. There's a maintenance shaft with a fuse box nearby. Follow the scaffolding. Says I need to turn the lights back on. Might take a minute. Fine. I'll keep my head down.
It's running. Do you think it'll work? Lousy place to get stuck. Just one way to find out. What's the probability a random passerby noticed a moving elevator in an abandoned hotel? Huh. <laughs> right. Leave the analytics to Songbird. Little fuckers are fidgety. Sharp sensors on those. If they've sensed us already, the place will be swarming in no time. Great reason to move on and keep moving. My thoughts exactly. And mine. Just stay calm and keep quiet. Something best avoided. Restaurant. Subnet access point in there. If you jack in, I can inject some fake hostile readings. Send the drones chasing after geese. Doable. I think we'd do best to sneak past them. all the work. Now's your chance to slip out. Tiptoes recommended. Work V. Confirm suspect's presence in the area. Better find him soon. Detecting multiple control sets, V. Stay on your toes. Uh, all right. Sync to a radio frequency. Hear me okay? Loud and clear, Would you care to tell me what the fuck is going on? 
have a friend in District 2. Elizabeth Cross Street. That's where you need to go. Streets are too hot, so you need to go on the ground. Like, literally. You'll take old metro tunnels. Find the nearest station beneath an abandoned expo hall. Got it. Scumbags won't run out. Lose them before accessing the garage. <sighs> that could have gone worse. We better evac. Outpost. Best go around. You found him yet? Better have good news for the Colonel. Fuck's sake, we're working on it! Hit the gas, B. Feed him dust! We really gotta cut that tail, B. Can't open the garage till you're off their radar. Cool and easy now. The less attention we draw, the better. Blood up.
the battle. For shit's sake. If they catch us out here, we're dead. They can't know we're not. Wipe them. Lose them. No call. in the clear. Tell me what the fuck is going on. We have a plan we need to stick to. Elizabeth Cross Street. That's where you need to go. The streets are too hot, so you need to go underground. Like literally. You'll take old metro tunnels. Find the nearest station where you can abandon Expo Hall. Got it. These scumbags might run out. Use them before accessing the garage.
Updates, anyone? Hello? Wake up, motherfuckers! Hit the gas, V. Feed them dust! Scumbags won't let up. Lose them before accessing the garage. They're tossing everything at us. Really gotta cut that tail, V. Can't open the garage till you're off their radar.
Looks clear. Fine. Nice change. Dogtown. What a joke. Did you all nuke this place? You all? First time I'm here. Likewise. And if I never make it back, it'll be too soon. It's like a kind of museum. <laughs> the Museum of Wishful Thinking. Where the rich bought and sold so many unfulfilled dreams. You been here before? Not quite. The place was built with Militech money. I was supposed to cut the ribbon on opening day. No need to delay. So quiet, I can hear my crone creak. Quiet's a good sign. You think so? I generally prefer lively places. Feel free to ask her about those exhibits. Really wonder what she'll say. It was an urban renewal effort, designed to curb Arasaka's growing influence. Militech backed most of the projects. So Militech sank money into Dogtown too? That's not what it was called then, but yes. On paper, urban renewal. Under that cover, military infrastructure development. But abandon all hope of hearing a word of truth. A bright future. With the right financing. But wars scare off investors. Wars don't happen out of the blue. This? No exception. Orders were issued. There's the Russell and Myers I know. Never a shadow of accountability. A gilded monument to a certain someone's bloated ego. Takes one to know one. Damn. There's no way around this? Songbird, got a sitch. Can you jimmy the door? On it. Ugh, the lock jammed. Gotta brute force it, B. Time to roll up your sleeves. No need. Three, two, one. <laughs> All right. Head for the elevator, just across the room. Huh. One of Hanson's warehouses, it seems. Gotta find an elevator. Other side of the room. Okay, here goes. V, do you hear that? Shit, bastard's caught up to us again. Songbird. Hey, bad news this time. Hanson's dogs caught your scent. Assault incoming. You probably got spotted outside. Either way, get ready. What now? Got a surprise for our guests. Making the final adjustments now. Need that. Nice. 
We gotta engage him. Song's on the case. Take him down! Starting to heat up in here, Songbird. Working on it. Hold on tight. First, I'll cut off his feet. Almost there. Still melting that over us. To me! Keep the pressure on! Songbird? What's with you? What the hell is going on, V? Dunno. Song's having a fit or something. Bitch went haywire! For fuck's sake, show me! Slap a muzzle on the thing! This way!
You're not dying on me today. Nope. Guess not. Right. Good. We take it out. The fall did. About time we caught a break. Uh, can't stay here. Are you mobile?
shit! Not dead yet! Look alive! Tech drone! Don't let him cut you up the fat one! You die already! Concentrate your fire on the drones! I'll cover you! One more? Hang in there! Don't get bright! Shit, bot.
safeguarding the nation. My ass. Yeah. Close call, that. <laughs> Good teamwork. And luck. A pile of luck, me. Grab what you can, and let's head out. There has to be an exit here, somewhere. Huh. What's this? Good stuff. I just hope this won't be a dead end. Songbird said to keep to the tunnels all the way to Elizabeth Crest Street. Any chatter from her? Zero. Dead quiet. Still. Not good. Come on! Fuck. Got a hatch here. Could we jump, maybe? Hold up, V. Let's pause. Think for a sec. What's eating you? I don't like this. Can you try calling so me again? Okay, gonna give it a shot. V to Songbird. Starting to worry us, girl. Song, are you there? No answer, huh? Guess you got me and only me. Great to see you again, Johnny. Curb the enthusiasm, kid. Never know. Could need me. So? Did you reach her? Nothing. No response. Shit. What happened back there? With So May? Tough to say. All happened in a blink. No one thing for sure. She was terrified. Like she had her worst fears boxed up and... That box popped open. Couldn't have said it better. I'm not sure I understand. You and me both. Somi's had occasional off moments lately. Temporary slumps. But I'm sure she's headed where we're headed. Same destination she gave us. It's the reasonable thing to do. Right. Reasonable. Girl's gonna have a hell of a hangover. If she wakes up. We're heading southwest now. Feels like we're circling back. Yeah. Saw mentioned an abandoned building. Place to lie low. No heat sig. Should be relatively safe. I pray you're right, Somi. Pushable, you think? Could use a little help. Of course. Oh! A damn fork? Well, we didn't account for this. Which way now? Thoughts? Hmm. Let's try this way. Looks promising. How to save his balls in here? Should plug that. Look for a.
Here we go. Betty, that's what we called her. Re-elected nine times. You believe it? She must have had her ass welded to that seat. Funny how she has her own street in Night City of all places. That jealousy I'm detecting? Please. Jealous of what? Ah! Oh, not now! V, are you- Ah, oh, one sec! It'll pass. Oh. See? Better already. What's the matter? Are you hurt? Yeah, could say that. Old wound. One that literally has you on the floor. Got a... experimental Arasaka biochip in my brain. It's killing me. Literally. Somi says she might have a solution. Wait. You're talking about the relic. That'd be the one. The secretive tech someone stole from Arasaka. On the day Saburo lost his battle with mortality, no less. Bingo. So that's how she could reach you. That also goes a long way toward explaining the nature of your deal. I appreciate the candor. Seems it's all for one and one for all, if we're to survive. Expecting more trouble? Tonight? I expect nothing but. It's best to be prepared for any contingency. Okay, this is us, safe. Great place for an ambush. Hopefully no one else thinks so. Fucking black. Where are you, Somi? Huh. Guess we got here first. Seems so. I'll have to sit tight. Though I assume I'd rather not sit in the dark. Power would be useful. We could also get the radio up and running. What? Can't miss our daily dose of fear-mongering? We need to know the situation on the ground. I'm gonna change out of this mess. Check this, V. Attempted postmodern art. More like a home cooked generator. Maybe we kickstart it. Literally. Uh huh. Ugh, shit. Thing needs a little go go juice to wake up. Sure, but seeing as we got a lull in the lead pouring down on us, listen. Got a bad vibe about this. You? Yeah, 
Makes two of us. Gig's got too many twists and turns. Songbird, S-tier netrunner, promises a panaceum, a cure-all, then gets wiped off the map. Myers, shady politico, got a dagger thrown at her back all the way from Washington. Who by, and why? Fuck if we know. Oh, plus Kurt Hansen and this fucking Sam launcher. Just preem. Got this hot itchy feeling in my groin. Like someone's not fessed up to something. Hmm. Huh. Saying Songbird didn't give us the full picture. Our mystery girl. Usually love a bit of hard to get, but trust me, rarely ends well. Well, not like we had time to really chat. Spent most of it running. SF1, run, Chimera, run again. It's just... Nah. Got some questions for the chick. Hope we get a chance to ask them. Anyway, let's get this power sitch sorted. Do the trick by my eye. In you go. Fire it up. Fingers crossed. Goes. And the maze balls. Look what I found. What do you say? There's more in the fridge. Feel free. You earned it. Just earn yourself a vote, Madam President. Are you even registered? Housewarming gift from Songbird, maybe? <sighs> Wouldn't it be wonderful? And circling back to Night City, speculative chatter continues tonight around the downed passenger craft. And U.S. representatives claim President Rosalind Myers was aboard when catastrophe struck. City officials have yet to release any statement. However, one all-too-familiar figure did decide to speak out. Kurt Hansen, the self-proclaimed leader of Dogtown, called a press conference earlier today to offer his take on the situation. I'm being framed. Isn't it obvious? The NUSA's been out for my blood for years. Now I'm not without flaws. But another thing I'm not is suicidal. An attempt on the life of the head of the NUSA? What transpired in Dogtown is no trivial matter. I urge you all to consider the true motives behind this... spectacle. The NUSA will take any excuse it can get to send forces into Dogtown. And will they stop there? <laughs> no. You, good people of Ninth City, are next in the fucking line. Shit. Mark my Fuck words. This. Troglodyte's clever. Maybe too clever for his own good. Not half dumb. Jumping on the media train, hollering war's coming. And it's all the NUSA's fault. Well, you sure know how to cheer people up. Some mysterious party's out to trigger war. An attempt on my life's a damn good case of spell eye. All the more reason for us to stay put. Got plenty of mysteries to solve. Songbird, Washington, Hansen. To name a few. Agreed. Hear that? Footsteps. Songbird? Maybe. Can't be.
be sure, though. It's our lucky day, Chumba. A penthouse with a view of the city. And lights that work. Well, this doesn't feel right. That never does with you, does it? Fucking killjoy. You want an angle on Hanson's airdrops? You got it. V, we need to eliminate them. Come on, man. Let's have a look around. Wait. I'll be dead. Want to try talking first? I hope you know what you're doing. Weapons! Now! What the fuck? I won't say it again. Yo, 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 chill. Just looking for a place to hold up for the night. This one's taken, clearly. Told you. So I see. This, the uh, presidential suite. Shit. Word is, they a bounty on the head of Rosalind Myers. What are we gonna do about that? Come on, guys. Let's figure something out. We don't want any problems. Iron in my face? Say otherwise. This iron will stay silent, so long as you do. Now that's an idea. But our silence ain't come cheap, yet. Yeah? Whoa. Pump the brakes, man. Not now, Tay. I was negotiating. Do you remember negotiating with Hanson? What happened? Not now. You negotiated with Hanson? What was that about? That small misunderstanding. Name Machete, this leg off. You motherfucker. Was it? Back the hell up! That's better. You negotiated with Hanson? What was that about? That small misunderstanding. Name Machete, this leg off. You motherfucker. Was it? Conflict of interest. Colonel Dipshit don't appreciate motivated entrepreneurs like myself. Now my question is, what can you offer us that's better? Chums, for fuck's sake. We're all just trying to survive here. So cool it, stop talking scop, and stay your price. One million. Fine. On one condition. You'll help. Lend us miscellaneous support. Mm hmm. And what's that supposed to look like exactly? There's enough space for four. Should be easy to stay out of each other's way. But if any uninvited guests arrive, we'll be counting on you to stand with us. This is your chance. There won't be another. Shit. But it might could be our last. Got a deal, Madam Prez. And want me a ray field. Jesus Christ. Aha. Uh -huh. Any model in particular? She, my ass will fit them all the same. Tell me where you want it parked. Will do, so long as your bodyguard don't slit our throats come nighttime. Well, V, do you plan to slit these two gentlemen's throats? Rest easy, Chum. Just mind your manners. Okay, I promise, Mama. Well, all fucking right. We got us a deal. I like to celebrate new chooms by tossing back a few, but T and I gots to be sharp. Airdrops come morning. Gotta get up early. Same here. Come on, V. It's been a hell of a long day. Watch the master and learn, T. Watch and learn. You're gonna get us killed one of these days. Maybe. But at least you'll kick it with a smile on your face and your balls in the right place. Looking for someone. Asian-American woman, about 30. Seen anyone like that? Well, it doesn't ring a bell. But shit, <laughs> you can't ask you to meet at a bar like a normal tune? You pull the night shift? Well, we could call it my part of the deal. And an old habit from the Badlands. So, you a nomad? I was. Once upon a time. Abandon your family? I betrayed them. I'd rather not get into it.
Sup, V? Shoot some shit with me? Let's spill it, my man. Working for the press. What's it like? Feds probably pay stacks, yeah? <laughs> I look like I'm from D.C. to you? <laughs> Fuck if I know. Never been. Nah, I'm Haywood, born and bred. Darktown native. No plan to leave, neither. Don't intend to take your shiny new Rayfield for a cross-country road trip? Chum, the day I believe a word out of anyone's mouth will be my last. Then why agree to a deal? Cause I's an honorable motherfucker, maybe? Shit, folks gotta live by some kind of code. Anyway, you made a wise choice for an overnight. Safe, out of the way. It's even got work and power. Mentioned airdrops before. What's that about? It's like this. Colonel Hansen runs a big market, but he's landlocked, right? Gotta get his shipments in somehow. Talking iron, ammo, meds, fucking anything. All falling out of the sky and into Kurt's lap. Now, if you know where and when to look, might fall into your lap instead. Feel me? Telling me fighters keepers? Clepping from Kurt? It's kid stuff. Trickle-down economics, I call it. So, one thing I don't get, building's safe, right? So why is it a total ghost town? Right. <laughs> See, well, that's because it's haunted. You ain't never heard the stories, dog. Jacob. It's true. A lot of peeps died here. Mysterious circumstances. Like an aneurysm, each and every one. One time, 12 runners they found. All their brains fried. Hanson closed the house down banned entry. And the colonel's word means lots more than some turrets and shit. Folks know to stay away. So what are we still doing here? Cause fuck them, that's what. And fuck urban legends. Finally. My legs are killing me. Come on. Still nothing from so me. Radio silence. She's never gone dark this long. Troubling, to say the least. How you feel about our roommates? None too bright. But not entirely useless. And two extra guns could always prove handy. Gonna give them that payday, really? Why wouldn't I? They're taking a sizable risk. So... What if Songbird don't show? We need to wait. It's all we can do for now. If she doesn't show, well... Then... I'll have one other option to consider. But let's table it till morning. We should get some rest. <laughs> Surreal. All of it. What's that? I'd have been home by now. Reading the evening brief, glass of water and two sleeping pills waiting on the night table. Doesn't sound like you miss it much. Hmm. See you in the morning, V. She's on the balcony. Where's Jacob? Fresh air drop nearby. Jay went down for a look-see. Sleep okay? Night all right? Like any with a roof overhead. Claustrophobic. As for Jacob, he thrives in dreamland. Come on, baby. Ever ridden in a rayfield? My villa with VIP friends? High society? On and on till the crack of dawn. A man with ambitions, clearly. Those in a deviated septum. She's not here. I Means she's not coming. You've seen the swarms Henson has out hunting? Might have nabbed her. 
possibility. One that concerns me the most. I need to find her. You don't leave your people behind enemy lines. Could it still buy that fairy tale bullshit? Whatever happened, we have to help her. Listen, I know we had a calm night, but you gotta leave Dogtown. How? In a car trunk? Fingers crossed? Hanson's waiting for that sort of desperate attempt. Okay. There gotta be a way. Let me think. Know my share of fixers, that we could get one Out of the question. They'll hand me over to the highest bidder. Got a talk backup plan. Not a plan, a man. The kind we need. Solomon Reed's the name. Seven years ago, he headed up our intelligence efforts in Night City. He and Somi were a team. With the conflict over, he went into hibernation. So he's out there somewhere. Reed's a man of principle. He can't be swayed, can't be bribed. If there's anyone we can trust now, it's him. A sleeper agent? No shit. Tell me more. Unless that's like a state secret or whatever. It is. Of the false bottom drawer variety. Let's say you want to secure your interests on another country's soil. If diplomacy fails, you resort to other means. Like a military coup. That's one option. Solomon Reed is another sure one. Reed guy sounds like an ace up your sleeve. Could have played him already. Activating a sleeper agent is no simple matter. You'll need a dog whistle. What now? Don't tell him I called it that. It's a signal only Reed will hear. It'll be tricky. Huh. There was a secret comms channel accessed only from a Capitan Caliente nearby. The FIA used it before the war. The access code was... 0931. Got a bad feeling, V. Meaning an analog landline. That crash tear open a hole in space-time? When sending sensitive information, you use the technology least vulnerable to interception. Old or not. That Caliente should still be wired for it. Owner have a thing for antiques? He had a thing for federal money. And he might still be alive. Remember, 0931. Okay, seems doable. And I prefer discretion to destruction. I trust that's clear. Uh-huh. So what'll happen next? Reed will need to screen you. You'll show him this. It means you work for us. What the? The file will be created for you in the FIA database. Wait, back up. Tell me I'm a special agent now. That's right. But taking the oath make it feel more real. Secret comms line, presidential token. What's next? A coded message in today's scream sheet? That token is for your safety. If Reed isn't 100% certain I sent you, he won't hesitate to kill you. Seems we're on the same side. Can't hurt. Oh, V. Repeat after me. I, V. Do you hereby solemnly swear? I, V, do hereby solemnly swear to faithfully serve the new United States of America. Fucking pathetic. To faithfully serve the new United States of America. I vow to uphold the values set forth in the nation's constitution and represent its government with dignity and due diligence. I vow to uphold the values set forth in the nation's constitution and represent its government with dignity and due diligence. 
I pledge to defend my country against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Should this cause claim my life, so be it. I pledge to defend my country against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Should this cause claim my life, so be it. On behalf of all NUS citizens, I thank you. Good luck out there, V. And don't let the bastards nab you. You know, taking that oath, bad idea. Oh, yeah? Some causes are worth pledging your life to, V. This ain't one of them. How'd you come to that? Because with the biz done, their arm will still be far up your ass and you'll be a meat puppet. No, I was once at Corpo Jarhead, right? Practically dove into uniform head first. They had a real hard-on for the oath. Repeat after me, bloody fucking blah. But can't remember what I solemnly pledged to do. Sure you want to talk about this? Forget it. You were just do a chewing out. Well, look who's away. See that crazy color smoke? Yep, wham bam. One of Hanson's cargo drops, no doubt. She all yours. I sure as shit ain't making that climb. Don't wanna climb or you're not telling me something? You think I'm finna parkour up on one leg? Thanks for the heads up. Maybe I'll take a look. Sure thing. 